All right, so let's get ready for our Hello World lecture. Uh, for this one, I'm just gonna make a new folder in my desktop. So I'm gonna clear this. I'm gonna CD desktop. And then I'm gonna make a new directory called uh, nim projects or nim tuts. Okay, I'm gonna CD into that directory. And then after that, uh, we're going to open this in code or whatever editor that you have. But I have code installed, which is Visual Studio Code. Uh, you can use Notepad++ or Notepad or Visual Studio, whichever editor uh, or IDE you like the best. I'm just going to open it Visual Studio Code, and this is my folder. All right, so now I'm just going to make a new file, and I'm going to call this Hello World. .nim. So uh, every nim file should have a .nim extension to it. I'm going to hit enter. And then if I go back to my studio code, you're going to see this file is created here. I'm just going to open this one. And hello world is pretty easy. It's as simple as typing echo. All right. And double quotes. And I'm going to type hello world. And that's it. That is your entire program. Okay. If you've come from other programming languages, you know, in Java, we did, you know, you had to do public, static, void, you know, main, and then string, you know, args, right? You had to do this. Then we had to come here. We had to do system dot, you know, print ln and then hello world or something like that, right? So that's what we had to do. So this was our Java program, right? Um, and of course you have to have like a public class here, blah, blah, blah. But in NIM, it's pretty simple. It's a scripting language. So uh, all we have to do is type in echo, hello world. And uh, if we go to git bash and to compile, and if you need help with any of the nim commands, all you have to do is type in nim bash dash help. And as you see, there aren't that many commands. It's just compile and doc, which generates documentation. And that's it. Everything else is an option, like run, dash b, which is version, uh, dash p, which is path, yada, 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 etc. So to compile this program, I'm going to type in nim compile or c by itself, which stands for compile. And I'm going to choose my file that I want to compile here, which is hello world.nim and type enter. And as you can see, we'll tell you operation was successful and it compiled uh, the program. And if I type in ls again, notice that we have a new file called hello world.exe. Now, this is what we compiled using mingw, which is the one we installed in the first lecture. Okay. So if I want to run this, all I have to do is type in dot slash hello world dot exe. And if I do that, it will print hello world to the screen. All right. Now you can also run and compile at the same time. And you can do that. You can type in nim compile. I'm just going to do compile this time instead of C and dash dash run or dash R for short. And then hello world uh, dot nim like that and it will compile it and execute at the same time it's a hello world so it will print it to the screen and that's it for the first hello world tutorial it's that simple all right this is a very uh i feel like simpler scripting language and uh we're gonna have fun in the later lectures all right thank you for watching and i'll see you next lecture peace